At this moment, these three people are actually using an insane strategy that you have never heard of before and you don't understand because you're not in it. And these guys are. These guys are so extremely smart with the business model they're using. And in this video, I'm exactly going to show you the business model that they use and how you can use it yourself to scale to seven figures and make millions a year get to understand that these people use a certain strategy that you probably never heard of before right alex ramosi has 1.3 million followers iman gazi has 2.6 million followers and hamza has 2.1 million followers and you you have 142 followers right so you're looking up on them but what you don't understand is the behind the scenes of these people what they understand that you don't understand right so in this video i'm going to explain you the model how you can copy the model and how you can scale to millions a year by using this exact model because this is powerful they never told you this i can tell you that nobody of those people tell you this right um they just don't tell you because they don't want you to know so get to understand this insane process that will create you insane leverage right it's all about leverage within a business whenever you don't create leverage you don't run a business you simply work a job so first of all in order for you to become famous in order for you to sell a lot of your products, you need to attract the mass, right? You need to be able to attract so much attention from people and you need to be able to generate so much attention. And the only way you can do that is by content distribution, right? All these people post content. Why do you think Alex Shamozi stopped running ads? His $100 million offers book said, I actually do 36 row ads, right? Why, why do you think he's not running ads anymore? Why do you think he's making organic content every single day, multiple posts? Because the return on investment on the content is way more effective than running ads, right? Why do you think Iman Gassi makes content every single day with the general approach with videos like, hey, how to change your life with these seven steps? He doesn't want to do it, but he needs to do it because the approach that you need to have to beginners is very specific it's very broad so you cannot niche down on a certain prospect because every single person has a pain and that is that they want to change their lives so iman gatsi need to speak to those 2.5 million followers right and the other hundred thousand or business owners probably but that is not where he makes real money from right right now he makes real money from his sauce but he understands where the money is and how we what for approach he need to have based on his position so he attracts those people same as hamza right hamza is an extremely extremely smart guy what he does is he is using the flywheel that i'm going to show you in a bit as well as these guys do um that produces him leverage that means that pr it produces him a money cycle that will never ever end right and you're just a jealous guy looking at these people and you don't understand the behind of the scenes of it, right? Let's get right into it. First of all, you need to generate attention. If you don't understand how to generate attention, you will never be able to become successful because why do you think these people are successful? It's not because of them, it's because of this, right? It's because of 1.3 million, 2.6 million, 2.1 million. That is why, that is why they make so much money, right? When you got attention, you need to stack that attention somewhere. And that is what all these people do. Let me give you an example, Alex Ramosi. He gives you his free book, right? He gives you access to your certain group. Iman Gatsi, agency navigator. He gives you access to a community. Hamza, right? Gives you access to a Discord. He, you need to stack the attention that you're getting somewhere. Obtain access to millions of users and stack them somewhere. Stack that attention somewhere in a platform that you have control of. Because when you send them to your YouTube and they follow, when they send it to Instagram and they follow or Discord and they join or whatever YouTube and subscribe, then they enter your world. He is opening the door for you to step through it, right? He is making sure that you enter his world because what creates it is whenever he um, lets you join his world by making sure you follow him on his socials is he creates influence, right? He is stacking that attention somewhere within a specific platform that he owns. So that means he has the influence over that, right? Whenever you follow me on my YouTube, that is exactly what you're going to do right now. <laughs> Stop, pause this video and give me a follow, okay? <laughs> because this is absolutely crazy value. By the way, whatever. Um, so get to understand that influence is being created when you when people enter your house they have to follow your rules right they have to follow your rules when people are outside on the street they can do whatever the fuck they want to do 
So get to understand that whenever these people are giving you access to a platform that they own, they have influence over you. What happens when influence get created? What do you think what happens when there's influence? The money has been made because Hamza is selling a course, right? And he's upselling a mentorship. So let's say 10,000 people join his course. Money has been made there, a shit ton of money, right? When we're, we're talking about millions, right? The mentorship, this is an upsell. 500 people are actually willing to join his mentorship. That is, for example, 1500. I don't know the exact prices, but this is an example, right? Could be less, could be more. So get to understand that influence is being created. When influence is being created, money has been made. It's the exact same thing. When someone has influence, he is able to convert attention. He is able to monetize attention. So what he is doing here, he is monetizing the attention that he actually got and that he actually put um, in the platform that he owns. So right now he is he is like taking money from these people, right? What happens is there are a lot of unknown answers, right? A lot of people with an extremely big pain. The reason why they paid Hamza or Iman, his course, or Alex Ramosi is because they have a pain and they want the solution for that pain. So that creates a community, a lot of people with the same pain and they need to have a solution for that, right? The questions are getting answered and asked, right? So the pain gets announced. That means it's in a chat within a Discord, for example, or in a community or anything. What do you think what happens after that? The pain gets solved. And how do you think the pain gets solved? By Hamza hopping on a call with these people in a group setting, leverage, of course, you're not gonna hop on a one-on-one -on -one call that doesn't create any leverage. So hops on a group setting, makes, does coaching for these people, records the call, and whenever saluting, solutions get created, whenever you record these, you create value, right? And what happens is you have a content piece, right? You have a case study within that content that you create. You have coaching footage. So you have a lot of different things that you've recorded from the solutions that you've provided for the people that paid you money, right? So value gets created because when you share a content piece, a valuable content piece that normally people paid money for, right? Important things get gonna happen because you create an insane content piece, a case study that is extremely valuable, right? that he is able to leverage in order for people to get to fall in love with him, right? As well as the content, food, the coaching footage, right? In order for people to fall in love with Iman, Alex or Hamza, you need to be able to provide value on a different way. And you create value by doing this. You don't create value by saying shit people don't care about, right? The reason why this video is going to get so much views is because I know how to have a certain approach. Generating attention and converting attention is a six figure skill set. When you're able to keep people's attention, you have a seven figure skill set. And that is a skill set that I own. The reason why you're still watching after eight minutes and 30 seconds is because I own a certain skill set that keeps you watching at my videos, right? And Value gets created because the, this video is valuable because these assets are valuable. People keep watching. What do you think when value gets created? People are going to listen. The attention gets created. Only reason why people watch videos if they think it's valuable. So it's a flywheel because what happens is he is providing value from the people that actually fucking paid him money. He's providing value, right? To those people. He's recording it. He's putting it online. As content assets and then the flywheel goes again because like who do you think who will see that content that valuable content that he pushed out to the market more people so he's obtaining access to more millions of users like it's a flywheel so he's giving them access more people are joining his discord more people are joining his course more people have a pain that needs to get solved more value gets created and it goes into a cycle and this is extremely smart because like it's an unlimited flywheel. It's like, it's like creating attention. It's like letting people pay for the solution that you can provide for their problem, right? It's recording the solution that gives the value to the market for free, right? That creates new attention. It's fucking insane. This is like so genius, right? And that is what these people all do. You don't, you probably don't like you see it. Like if you think about it, but normally when you see their videos, they look like very friendly, normal people. They are, but like, you get it? This is so fucking smart. This is, this is genius. And that is what this man also did. So like, get to understand this process. Hopefully you guys um, thought that this video was valuable because get to implement this for your own business. Create an effect 
wheel. Cre- create like an, this is like the most insane lead generation process that you can generate. You can do cold outbound, you can do ads, you can do YouTube videos, whatever. Create fucking this flywheel. When you create this flywheel, you have, like it's a cycle, right? And a cycle, a circle is never ending, right? A circle is never ending. So that means that it's so much leverage for himself and it's a flywheel that he produces in order to generate the results that he wants to generate. It's fucking insane. Guys, hopefully this video was valuable. Whenever you want our, whenever you want our help with implementing these client acquisition methods, right? What we do is all free farming content creation. We install you setters, as well as we make sure that we built you the systems that are able to sustain the growth that you're facing. Send me a DM on Instagram. We're gonna skill your company to 50K a month, um, guaranteed. So don't worry about that. Shoot me a message. We're gonna make sure it's gonna happen. Um, and yeah, guys, like get to understand this process, right? You can let us do it. You can implement it yourself, but make sure that you also watch all my other videos. It's absolutely phenomenal value. And um, yeah, guys, hopefully you'll see you next time. Ciao, ciao.